think like when you mentioned clap, um, it's such a pure song. And then we see technology drive through so much of Yes's music um, from Tormato to Relayer. Relayer is like really my favorite, um, Close to the Edge. I'm curious in your, from your perspective, as we go through this time period where we're going to have AI generated music and, and more and more of um, computers creating music, do you feel that we're going to lose something as, um, let's say, uh, machine generated music replaces individuals? There's no doubt we will. Of course we will. But if you look back over the stepping stones of technology in, in musical recording, each step, I mean, I couldn't get, like the fax machine, I mean, technology, other stuff, you couldn't wait to get rid of that damn machine, you know, and get something else. And I think that, that those kind of leaps happen. But when you look back, you suddenly realize that some of them had great benefits. And this was the dilemma with CDs, you know. Oh, where's the bass end? It doesn't quite feel the same. And, you know, records, you know, you do feel it in, in, in the way that the bass end is, is transported through your speakers. It's just different. It's analog. So there will always be a slight price to pay. I mean, I like to think that we're moving two steps ahead and one back all the time. So we do make these jumps and who would have known, you know, the difference the internet would make to our lives and, and how it's changed so many, many things, like us talking, you know, in, in a, and, and with a quality of sound that isn't like a, a phone, you know, like it used to be, you know, even if it was going through a satellite. 